Hi, my name is Andrea from Science of Life. In this tutorial, I show you how to do your first steps in flight planning in Emotion Free. Upon opening Emotion Free, it brings you to the welcome screen. In the welcome screen, you select which drones you're gonna use. Here, we're gonna use EV Plus with the camera soda. You could use other cameras with the EV Plus as well. You can give your mission a name. And then it takes you to the mission tab. This is where you can now find the location where you want to fly and set up all your parameters. So let's find the place. This search only works as long as you have internet. We're gonna do a flight here at Sensefly Headquarters. First, you will set your working area. This is the zone in which the drone is allowed to fly. Right now, the zone has a radius of 500 meters and 150 meters in altitude. Feel free to adapt it to your country's regulations. Afterwards, don't forget to hit the download map data. This will ensure that you have your background map and the elevation data offline available. After this, you go on to the third tab here, where we set up our flight blocks. We add a mission block by clicking here on the little drop down next to the plus sign. Click on horizontal mapping and keep it simple for now. And then you are free to define the area that you would like to fly. You can do this either in 2D view or 3D view. With the little round here, you can change the direction of your flight lines. It's good to adapt it to the current wind direction. This first flight block can be named. We make sure it has selected the right camera that we're going to fly with. Plan above elevation data, the resolution, which will change your flight altitude. Now at 2.8 centimeters per pixel, we are going to fly at 119 meters above elevation data. Then you can also choose your lateral overlap and longitudinal overlap. If you're flying in more difficult situations or complex weather situations, um, it's good to increase a bit this overlap. Once you're ready with your first flight block, feel free to add another one. This second flight block will just be added to the list of flight blocks in your mission. You can either then fly all at the same time or one after the other. But everything is already planned. And with this we finish this tutorial. Watch the next one for more details on how to set up your start and home waypoints, how to simulate your mission and how to set up your RTK PPK source.